committee's main challenges with this exercise were to try to save time, improve accuracy and improve reproducibility when we're assessing and selecting human embryos. Care Fertility came to us with a really wide-reaching question around how we can apply artificial intelligence and machine learning to the field of embryology. They had a huge data set of over 63,000 embryos and 10 years worth of, of information. So it was a fantastic um, playing field for us to, to, to explore in. We take the images from the embryoscopes and we ingest those into the AWS cloud environment that we've created, run them through a couple of machine learning algorithms, which essentially takes annotations from the sequence of images and then displays them to the embryologists so that it massively speeds up their workflow so they can get to the results much, much quicker. The interface works brilliantly, it's been perfect and we've rolled it out across all of our clinics, saving time for our embryologists in the laboratories, it's improving accuracy as we wanted it to and most importantly it's making a difference for our patients so we're able to select the very best embryo sooner than we may have otherwise. We're now implementing it across our new clinics so we're doing an integration programme so it's been a really valuable tool. This project's given us great confidence to explore other opportunities because we have such a large data set and we're looking for incremental gains. We want our patients to have the best possible chance of success. So this tool works with embryo selection. We can explore other opportunities such as looking at the data that we collect from ultrasound scans, looking at the data related to prescribing protocols, medications. So there are many opportunities to keep moving this forward. This was a fantastic project to be a part of. BJSS technologists were there working side by side with the embryology team. We developed a genuinely world-class solution that will improve the prospects of success for future parents.